Can they stay perfect? You tell me. <laughs> G'day fellas, welcome back to the Charleston Tech Dynasty. We have finally hit first place. So as it would appear, Stanford is one of the best teams we're gonna verse all season. We cannot underestimate these guys. That's when things start to go really negative for us. Kevin Turner is still apparently injured. That's no bloody good, but they're gonna be without their quarterback and their wide receiver. Their quarterback is going to be Brian Madison. This guy cannot scramble to save his life. I mean, he's nearly a better quarterback though. So this guy can't really throw it fast, but he's got some accuracy to him. Now they only have one receiver over 90 overall in Marcus Williams. Now that uh, George Powers here is injured. And from the look of things, we have an overwhelming lead on a lot of people now, including Terrence Pope. 2,800 lead on him, essentially in the bag. And our points are already maxed out. I kind of just came here to update you guys, if anything. Still only signed three people, but in the next coming weeks, there should be a lot of brand new faces that will officially have committed to the team. Somehow we have three people in the top five of NCAA tackle leaders. Surprisingly, Alan Brown, the strong safety, is leading the nation. That just tells me that they're getting to our secondary a lot. With that being said, fellas, it's time to jump into the game. If you are new around here and you enjoy NCAA and Madden content, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to sub. Also, all my social medias are down in the didgeridoo. Make sure you drop your boy a follow. It's much appreciated. I just got this ranking. I don't want to lose it, boys. Let's jump into it. This is, uh, this is in Chicago, right? For some reason, I thought it was the, the Cincinnati Bengals at first. First game at rank one. We already have him in a third down early. I'm watching out for this screenplay, mate. Pat Thompson is ready. Lurking. He's going to get sacked again. This quarterback has no idea what to do. What a way to start the game. Marcus Elliott is back from injury. Jeremy Richards, I'm pretty sure, is back as well. So that's some good news. Here we go, Marcus. Ooh -hoo -hoo. What is this? Play action boot screen. Does it have to be so complicated? Can I just give it to the, the running back like normal? Okay, that play is disgustingly bad. Oh, uh, they're on me. Absolutely no block in. We're going to have to give it back to him. That sucks. Yeah, we're pretty much going to be sending the blitz the entire game. And if he wants to cut it out, I'm going to be there for him as well. I'm probably going to end up cutting a lot of these drives out. <laughs> They're just so boring. It's been a pretty poor game to start out. Willie Ward, though, looking to change that up on a nice little punt return. I don't think Stanford is really one of those, uh, you know, man coverage teams. Take that. Let's go, Javon. Keep the drive alive. You got a thing, right? Eventually, they're going to come out in man. They did last time we did a screenplay. This time, they didn't. But just like last time, we get no blocking again. Still waiting for me blocker to rock up. He's got to be around here somewhere, right? Every time I snap the ball, it's just pressure, pressure, pressure. Here we go. It's finally man coverage. Matt West. He's going to drop it. Let's go, Pat Thompson, the free safety. The first play on defense. Pick six. That's his first pass as well. Now I feel kind of bad. We're not even taking on a full strength Stanford team right now. And it's uh, fairly obvious. <laughs> this quarterback is going to struggle a lot today. Pick it. Wow, okay, at least we pushed him out of bounds. We'll take it. Wait, how is the time still ticking? Is that a glitch? How does that work? Uh-oh. Come on, we've got conservative tackling on. Lock him out, hopefully. Third and four. I don't even think they've got a first down yet. It's gonna be another sack, Brian Jenkins, this time. The whole team. We're passing the quarterback around. He's sloppy seconds at this point. If you catch me drift... If we end up getting, you know, 30 yard line or something, I might even just chew the clock out. If we go off 14-0 at half and we get possession, oh, this game's already in the bag. Granted, we get some blocking. Oh, he's wide open, bro. Look at this. Mad West, spin move. Ooh Nearly got away from the both of them. You see that play? That's a pick. 
Yep, as soon as I let that go, I knew that was an interception. And somehow, somehow, I still thought that was the right play. <laughs> I don't know how he got through that gap, but he did. Good on him. Let's take it down. Okay, we got a truck as well. All I wanted was the catch. On the left, boys. It's finally mere coverage. They fell for it. <laughs> One minute and 56 to go. We can score this. We might even get Javon open here up the side. No, that's a weird looking blitz they got. Go triangle. That's a laser. Rivero. All right, I'm getting right out of the pocket here straight away. Gotta take off. It's mere coverage. He's so slow, yet nobody can catch him. You know what I mean? It's funny how I was mid-slide animation, but because I slid, I got picked up and Batista bombed on my back, mate. <laughs> That's crazy. Cool animation. Right across the middle, Rivero! Open space! 45 seconds left! Go, 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 come on! Oh, wow! We fall just short. Come on, Matt West. Ah, I shouldn't have scored, man. We've left him with too much time. Good play, though, man. I love it. All right, quite the weird first half there. A lot of turnovers, a lot of weird touchdowns. I'm glad that we are at least tied going into the second, but... Here we go, Javon. Let's just take it easy, my guy. All right, just take that. Yes, we got the block. Woo! We got bailed there. That play was not meant to work that well. Oh, crap. They are just hit-sticking everybody. Relax, mate. You don't need to hit-stick everybody. You know, you're not trying to hurt my players out there. Unless you are. In that case, you're a dick. Let's go, Javon. Nice blitz coming. No worried. Oh, it's like they just know what we're going to call in advance. It's just so much fun to play against. And would you look at that? We don't have the kicker. At least coach wants to go for it, though, you know? That's, that's kind of respectful right there. Just doesn't want to bend over and give him the ball back. I might even just take this. Got to take it safe. Go, Jeremy. Don't fumble it. Okay, squares wide open. And we're gonna get sacked. I'm sorry, Jeremy. I'm not trying to get you hurt, mate. I think we might even be out of field goal range now, which is not good. Maybe they call him in, though, because it does look like a blitz. Get him! Let's go, David Ross with the first down. You'll also notice I'm chewing the clock. I get it. It's a big game and everything. I just, if we do score here, I don't want Stanford left with a lot of time. But even in saying that, it's still kind of necessary. By the way... Uh, Jeremy Richards is injured because of that last sack that he took. I think we might have to put in that guy again. I just said I can't be dicking around, so I don't want to not give it to Marcus Elliott, you know? Get that blocked. Yes! Triangle gets the block. We're in the end zone, mate. And I'm telling you, pretty much all we're going to be doing is sending the blitz. I'm not worried about their offense at all. They bring nothing to the table. Now that I've insulted them, watch them dominate us. But uh, for real, this quarterback is, is pretty trash. Big Ed! Wow, you're just going to let him dot us up like that? Nice. Well, we all know what this is going to be. It's a run play. Come on, bring him down, man! Oh my goodness. We have conservative tackling on, ladies and gentlemen. I don't like how defenders are bad. Like, they can tackle... Oh, even the backer. Stop, stop. That is way too close. Don't unsub. I didn't mean to jump scare you with the weird tree that Stanford has. I'm in the backfield with Alan Brown. Let's go. I don't know if I want to go zone coverage here. I think this is the one play we really have to. Come on, Jenko. Screenplay, I'm on it. Ow! 
Okay, we're there. Never mind, boys. We're there. Time is ticking. They're taking a field goal. I'm running this clock out, mate. I'm not even going to risk it. Coach, we're not passing it. What are you smoking on the sideline? We're rushing this ball out. It's quite obvious. Here we go. Just like three, four yards of carry. We're chilling. Oh, this is kind of risky, but it doesn't look like a blitz. Then again, we're running at a star player. Yes, we get down to third and three, man. Man coverage hasn't exactly worked for us, but we just need that first down. Right there. Yes, Watkins. Let's go, boys. There's only so much that I can kind of joke around in the game. It still managed to come away with a dub, you know? <laughs> but I, I like to play it safe when I can. Home stretch, 45 seconds left. We're up by four. Woo, this was another sweaty another tough game mate let's try this they got a safety deep and everything go matt oh he's gonna drop it but either way we're walking away with another dub we are eight and oh fellas and we have ohio state next episode checking out the stats on the day jeremy richards went out multiple times today with injury but still found a way to dominate 222 yards one touchdown one pick 66 percent completion rate marcus elliott he came in when he needed to he did some cool things out there as well rushing in 40 yards 27 and 20. this is going to be a trend i would like to pick it up but i don't think it's going to happen and on the receiving end tim rivero of all people this guy is a 79 overall junior pretty sure that's the first game in his whole career he's gone over 100 but yeah matt west 56 yards and a touchdown he did everything today blocking mixed bag and on the defensive end brian jenkins leading the team four total tackles we had two sacks on the day six tfls one pick to pat thompson that was a pick six again we don't get that pick six we don't win the game forehead but yeah fellas that's gonna wrap up this episode of charleston tech four games left in the regular season ohio state next week hopefully you guys are hyped you made it this far you're the real mvp hope the rest of your day is awesome and from me personally i'm out peace